trip. We're on the float in the Buffalo for the first time with our three kids, my sister and her son and his butt crack. And my sister in law and her two kids. And we're at lunchtime already. We literally just got in our boats, but we uh, got a later start than usual. So a BLT, she smashed, but look how glorious that is. Thanks to Sarah's excellent navigational skills. We know we've made it because it says reserve for Kimmy B. Don't I feel special? We're gonna camp now. No, so those no, are our accommodations no, for the night. And a hammock. There's Finley. <laughs> but it is uh, hot dog time. Kimmy, your wiener roasting technique, spot on. I don't know though, Kina. Kina's got the stance. She does have a good stance. It's but strong. Look at how droopy her pole yeah, look at is. how heavy my wing is. <laughs> <laughs> She's got a pole droop. I like to squat down lower to help with the pole. Droop. I see you got good leverage oh, there. Yeah, also this I gotta like really lean to the side so I have room. I give Kina this style points though. Got the Captain Morgan right. going on. I, I'm not gonna... Is that better? Nice. So Benjamin's eating a salad and Silas is crushing a hot dog. I've got some. I don't like the bun, so I've got Doritos oh, and a weenie oh, it's and a sunflower crunch yeah, salad. And Benjamin bought me this delicious tasty beverage to have. First, you put the toast the mallow. You put the chocolate on the gram. Then you put the mallow on the chocolate. Slide her off. That's the perfect technique. Smash her down and enjoy. I like to go double mallow, three, what are they called? Tabs? Ch uh, Chaps, squares. Squares of chocolate with an untoasted graham cracker. Did you get a fork? Go for it. Your finger hurt? Mm -hmm. She grabbed the metal. Mom, look. I mine haven't even got catched. Hey, Dad, Mom's got on catched on fire. Like Mom's <laughs> crazy. <laughs> it's been a very long day, and we're gonna try to go to sleep now. I've got a little tiny fish. 
piano over there and Ben just went to the car to get the screwdriver so that I could change the batteries in this van so we can hopefully uh, have a little bit of airflow while we try to sleep but it's late and we're all cranky and hot so we're gonna try to straighten this battery thing out and get some sleep. Come on, come on. Get a close up of the star. Chef's case. <laughs> Maybe. We'll cut that part out. <laughs> I didn't do the appropriate amount the first time. Oh, that's good. You want some? Yep. And now we're gonna warm up some biscuits. <laughs> We've got Benjamin. Luckily, they have these weird little fires. We have the smallest cast iron skillet. Thank you, Granny Pat. And we're just gonna warm them. Don't you like how you like you try to make a giant fire in the fire pit, and then a giant fire and, happens over there they, with three sticks. It sticks. doesn't, and then I come over here and I try to make a little fire, and it's blazing. Yep. Quit poking it while I get the pan off? with a stick. And a sure towel. Like a t-shirt? I've got towels over there. But we go, totally we go for real on these breakfasts. We don't need to talk about how many biscuits I'm having. But I've got biscuits, some bacon, a boiled egg. Just going to crack a little salt on there. I'm going to take the honey with me. And my coffee. And this is a magical breakfast. And no matter where you are, but outside is even more fun. Oh yeah, sorry. <laughs> How much fun did you guys just have? A lot. A lot. Was that the best first camping experience ever? Yeah, I had fun roasting. I was having fun roasting marshmallows and hot dogs. Yeah, marshmallows and hot dogs. So we are officially heading home now once we get some directions because we don't know where we're going. And we haven't showered. We've all brushed our teeth. Um, at the spigot, <laughs> that says there's a spigot back there, next to our campsite. Um, yeah, and we did the most, um, what do you even call that? Like, janky bath ever. We There's not a shower here, just a bathroom. So we took a bar of soap and in the sink and just kind of like tried to wash some sunscreen off and washed our faces and everything. We went to bed last night. So we've got hair from the river and we all stink and it was a rough night sleep because it was hot and then Silas was having some bad dreams so he was like crying and Bear couldn't get comfortable so it was like rustling around. But it was an awesome breakfast, a, a great time being with our family and just like a fun adventure, a good, for, a good experience, don't you think? Yep. So anyway, we're headed home now. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you haven't ever been to the Buffalo River in Arkansas and floated, it's really fun. Even though it was really hot, we were all worried that we were gonna be suffering because it was so hot. 
it was fine. We got to, you would get in the water when you wanted to. It was great. We had such a good time. Benjamin was so diligent with making us stop and get sunscreen on every like hour. That we have no burns. Everyone is happy. Uh, so that's a plus. And then we camped at Buffalo Point Campground, which is just like up the road from where we floated, which was really great. Um, and it was awesome. We had our own private area, group campsite. We set up three tents and had a great time. So anyway, if you haven't ever done anything like that here in Arkansas, highly recommend. It was really fun. Um, it was our first time, so it was a learning curve for us. There's definitely some things we would do different next time, some other things we would bring with us. But all in all, I had a great time. So I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope it was entertaining for you to watch us make some stupid camping mistakes if you're a pro. Um, but yeah, uh, thanks for watching and we'll see you next time. Ben, say bye. 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 <laughs>